just completed the tack. Richard at the helm. And Bronco is grinding. So, uh, true wind speed showing 9.8. Uh, 9.9. Okay, I'm 25 on this side, and I'm flying yeah, pretty nice. They're not the same. They will not be the same. Numbers. Okay, so we have to calibrate it. We, they, it will be when we. we found that too. Will yeah, be when we out. finish calibrating it. Okay, just let me let me just a second now. Hold it. Let me get this down here. Our speed is way off too, because we were at 4.8, so I don't think we're in the groove yet. Okay, just let's give us. Let, let's start. We got we got to bring that main. That means got to come in a bit. We're not centered. Okay, I'm gonna let Bronco handle that. Yeah. Uh, I'm at 4.3 yeah. at 31. Right? Yeah. Okay. That's, he's looking good. Okay, so our speed is back up. I'm looking at. I'm looking for 4.7 now. Yeah, I'm looking for 4.7548 near on the uh, on this. That's better. That's better. Yeah. Okay. Now we're coming up. Okay. Now we're coming up. 4.9. Five one. Okay, that's just about the same boat. And three. thirty one is what we were, right? The boat we hadn't settled in and completed yeah. the acceleration on our attack. And so now we're looking at um, we're not looking at exactly the same numbers okay, because let me get this thing right in the right in the get it in the groove and let us know when you're in the groove there, Richard. Yeah, let me get her in. Yeah. There we go, right there. Just a second, a little bit more. A little bit more. Right there. We go. Right there. That's the number right there. That's right on. Right there. Okay. So we're looking at uh, exactly the same wind speed as the other. 10.9. 11. Both the same. And we're looking at a heading of 204. And we're looking at uh, a 30 degrees apparent. And um, 4.9. So the numbers are, once we've settled in and got the sails adjusted, the numbers are very, very similar. Yeah, I'd say um, maybe about one degree or so. Oh, yeah, one, maybe yeah, two. yeah. And wind speed has come up a little. We're up to 11.3 yeah, now, which counts for our increase in boat speed. So, uh, but you know what's beautiful with this is that you always know where you are, right? And if you're night sailing, yeah. Yeah. you can uh, go on upwind, you can uh, sail on those numbers. And we're breaking, we're breaking unevenly too. The uh, high the tops tip. are breaking before the bottom. Yeah, so we have to adjust the sheeting angle. Yeah. Uh, and not only that, we don't have enough tension on the uh, on 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 the, on the sail. On the Yeah. You know what? Maybe the block should be able to. You mean the halyard? Yeah. Oh, cool. oh, yeah. The the yeah. halyard needs more tension. Yeah. Is what you're the saying. See the skull in yeah, yeah. 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 Right. I had seen that before. So. Yeah. So. So, should we tighten this? Yeah. Uh, you're not going to be able to do it now. Uh, no. Uh, no, no, okay. Yeah. We'd have to go head to wind. Yeah. Because I know um, when we had the right. racing sails on, yeah. 